I get asked often what's the best 3D printer for beginners, what are the top 3D printers if I'm on a budget, what's a good 3D printer to get my children involved in. If these are the types of questions you have, then you're in the right place. Hello everyone, my name is Nav and in this video I'll be showing you my top 10 recommended 3D printers for beginners that you can buy right now. There's never been a better time to get into 3D printing, but when starting on this journey, you're immediately overwhelmed with the vast amount of choices available today. I have put in countless hours researching the industry, so rest assured, you're in good hands. I've also personally used some of my favourites in this list. I have carefully put clear and concise information to help you make your decision, so you can find the best 3D printer for your needs. All the printers that I'll be showing you are listed below in the description as well as the links with the latest prices for the UK market as well as international. Also note, this list is not in any particular order. So let's dive in. Number one on the list is the XYZ Printing Da Vinci Mini Maker, a great budget printer priced at $287.99. Print technology is fused filament fabrication, print volume is 150mm cube, minimum layer resolution of 100 microns, maximum layer resolution of 400 microns. Dimensions are 390 by 335 by 360 millimeter, weighing in at 10 kilograms. The XYZ Printing Da Vinci Mini is a great budget friendly printer and it certainly won't break the bank. It's very easy to use with a simple user interface so your kids can join in on the fun too. It also comes in vibrant colours so it's clearly aimed at the younger generation. Don't be fooled by its price though, as this gem can produce some impressive results thanks to its maximum resolution of 100 microns. The design and compact size makes it ideal for any desk at home, office or school. Just bear in mind that you're stuck with using XYZ printing branded filaments, so it could become costly to run in the long run. However, apparently on the current batches of printers, this restriction has been uplifted but just make sure with the manufacturer before ordering your printer. The pros are cheap, ease of use and design. The cons, cannot use third party filaments unless you get the newer batch. Number two on the list is the M3D Micro 3D Printer, great for printing small items and priced at under 150 UK pounds. Print technology is fused filament fabrication, print volume is 116 by 109 by 113 millimeter, minimum layer resolution of 50 microns, maximum layer resolution of 350 microns. Dimensions is a tiny 185 millimeter cube, weighing in at only one kilogram. As soon as you look at the M3D Micro 3D printer, you'll be thinking this thing is so cute. Well, at least your kids will think so. This printer is a budget friendly printer, but the best thing about this printer is, you guessed it, it's tiny size. It will take no space on your desk at all. In fact, you'd want to buy a few of these and have them stacking side by side, printing multiple objects at the same time. However, as this is a low resolution printer, don't expect great quality. It's very quiet to run too and an excellent choice for, to get your children involved in the fun. Pros, size, design, user friendly and quiet. Cons, it's a little slow, print quality is not that great and the print volume is tiny. Number three is the Flash Forge Finder. It's a great all-rounder and priced at a bargain for £260. Print technology is fused filament fabrication, print volume is 140mm cube, minimum layer resolution of 100 microns, maximum layer resolution of 500 microns. Dimensions are 420mm cube, weighing in at 20 kilograms. The Flashforge Finder is a great 3D printer with impressive print quality for the price. Right out of the box, this printer is completely pre-assembled. Just do the assisted bed leveling and you're ready to start your adventure. It's a quiet printer and the speed is fairly good too. It's Windows and Mac compatible. And the great thing is you can use third party filaments. Hence, long term use is cost effective with this printer. It's a large printer and the print bed is not huge and not heated either so you will require a glue stick to prevent print warping. Overall, a great all rounder with exceptional print quality. This was actually my very first 3D printer. I made a video review of it that you can check out by clicking on the link above. Pros, print quality, user friendly and being able to use third party filaments. The cons, print volume and the printer size itself. 
Number four on the list, we have the Creality CR-10S. Huge print volume for just £369. Print technology is fused filament fabrication. Print volume is a massive 300 by 300 by 400 millimeter. Minimum layer resolution is 100 microns. Maximum layer resolution is 300 microns. Dimensions is 615 by 600 by 490 millimeter, weighing in at 13 kilograms. The Creality CR-10S had to make the list for its huge print volume and the biggest bang for your buck you can get. It's not the best looking 3D printer in the world, but it surely is a winner. It has great print quality, heated bed, fast print speed, and did I mention its massive print volume? This printer will require some assembly, but after watching some unboxing videos, you'll realize it won't take you more than 15 minutes. It's Windows and Mac compatible, and you're free to choose whichever slicing software you like. This is the ideal 3D printer if you want to go straight into big printing volumes without spending a big volume of cash. Truly a favorite amongst the DIY community. Pros, print volume, print quality, heated bed, being able to use third party filaments. Cons is the design and some assembly required. Number five on the list, we have the XYZ Printing Da Vinci Nano. Another compact favorite for only 189 pounds. Print technology is fused filament fabrication. Print volume is 120 millimeter cube. Minimum layer resolution is 100 microns. Maximum layer resolution is 300 microns. Dimensions is 378 by 280 by 355 millimeter, weighing in at 4.7 kilograms. The XYZ Printing Da Vinci Nano has stepped into the ring of compact and affordable printers, and it's done a great job. This printer comes fully assembled with auto leveling software and an auto feeding filament system, making setup, calibration, and maintenance a breeze. Like the M3D, the Nano is aimed at consumers who want to try out 3D printers with family, especially with children. It's light enough to take to a friend's house to share the fun too. It has an enclosed printing area with a door and also a removable print bed to make removing objects a simple process, making it very safe to use around small children. The pros, compact size, ease of use, design and quiet. The cons, cannot use third party filaments and slow. Number six, we have the Tier Time Up Mini 2, a stylish compact printer with a price tag of 550 UK pounds. Print technology is melted extrusion modeling, print volume is 120 millimeter cube, minimum layer resolution of 150 microns, maximum layer resolution of 350 microns. Dimensions are 255 by 365 by 385 millimeter, weighing in at eight kilograms. The Tier Time Up Mini 2 is one of the best looking 3D printers around, but don't let the pretty looks deceive you. This printer is packed with high-end features, including a fully enclosed heated enclosure, touchscreen controls, HEPA filtration with activated carbon and a metal frame. The software is user-friendly with auto bed leveling to get you started in no time. It's a very quiet printer thanks to its fully enclosed heated printing area and because it's heated, you can also use ABS filaments too with minimal warping. Overall, a great looking printer, perfect for beginners and portable to carry with its aluminium carry handle. Pros are compact size, design, quiet, HEPA filter, being able to print various filaments. Cons are print volume, limited slicing software. Number seven, the Flash Forge Adventurer 3. New generation smart printer with a reasonable price of 349 pounds. Print technology is fused filament fabrication. Print volume is 150 millimeter cube. Minimum layer resolution of 100 microns. Maximum layer resolution is 400 microns. Dimensions are 388 by 340 by 405 millimeters, weighing in at nine kilograms. The Flashforge Adventurer 3, also known as the Monoprice MP Voxel, is a new generation of 3D printers and it's packed with smart features. It comes pre-assembled and it doesn't require any leveling or calibration. Just insert the filament into its auto feeding system and you're good to go. It has a slightly larger print volume to the Flashforge Finder, but at the same time it's a smaller overall size, as well as it being lighter. It's extremely quiet thanks to its fully enclosed and it also has an HD monitoring camera which is normally found in high-end printers. The build plate is flexible, removable and heated so you have the option of using a number of different types of filaments including ABS. 
I also made a video review of this printer too that you can check out clicking on the link above. Pros, print quality, user friendly, quiet, heated bed and HD monitoring camera. Cons, small filament holder. Number 8 on the list we have the Monoprice Select Mini V2, award winning budget friendly printer at just £199. UK. Print technology is fused filament fabrication, print volume is 120mm3, minimum layer resolution is 100 microns, maximum layer resolution is 200 microns. Dimensions are 343 by 287 by 190 mm weighing in at 4.5 kilograms. The Monoprice Select Mini V2 is a well-known 3D printer and is clearly a favourite amongst beginners thanks to its budget-friendly price. The printer has also been recommended for a number of years by all 3DP and it's still a huge competitor on the market. It's completely open source so you're free to use your favourite filaments as well as slicing software. Sometimes it may require some minor tweaks, so it may not be the recommended printer if you want a hassle-free printer. It's very compact and lightweight to complement any office decor. As the printing area is exposed, this is not recommended to use around young children. The pros, open source, heated bed and price. The cons, a little noisy, extruder sometimes gets jammed. Number 9 on the list we have the Anycubic Photon which is a budget-friendly resin printer for under £300. Print technology is digital light processing. Print volume is 115 by 65 by 155 mm. Minimum layer resolution is 25 microns. Maximum layer resolution is 100 microns. Dimensions is 220 by 220 by 400 mm. Weight is 6.6 kilograms. When compared to other resin printers, the Anycubic Photon is extremely affordable. Up until now, high resolution resin printers would cost thousands, but this company has started a much welcomed change. If you don't like the layers lines on finished objects that many 3D printers leave behind and you're interested in smooth high quality prints, then this is the ideal printer for you. You just have to remember that printing with resin requires safety gear, caution, post processing and patience. However, don't let that scare you away as the Anycubic Photon is easy to use. It just requires a little more time for maintenance etc. It's been voted by many as the best budget resin 3D printer. Pros, price, high quality prints and compact. Cons, resin can be a bit messy, safety gear required. Finally, number 10 on the list we have the Dremel Digilab 3D40, which is ideal for the hobbyist price at 799. But if you do some searching on Google, then you can also find it for under 500 UK pounds. Print technology is fused deposition modeling. Print volume is 254 by 152 by 170 millimeter. Minimum layer resolution is 100 microns. Maximum layer resolution is 300 microns. Dimensions are 515 by 394 by 406 millimeter, weighing in at 16 kilograms. Up until a year ago, this printer would not have been on my top 10 cheap 3D printers list. However, the price has now come way down on the Dremel 3D40. Although Dremel is known for their multi-tools, they also offer some great 3D printers too. If you're looking for a workhorse and you want a reliable 3D printer, then the Dremel Digilab 3D40 is the way to go. It's the ideal printer for any education environment thanks to the fully enclosed printing area. The print quality it produces is exceptional with 100 micron layer resolution. It comes fully assembled from the factory and includes everything you need to go from unboxing to your first print in under 10 minutes. The print bed is removable and the size is also adequate for most enthusiasts. In conclusion, this is an ideal printer for hobbyists or a teacher wanting to invest in their first 3D printer. Pros, price, speed, print volume, ease of use and quiet. Cons, no heated bed, prints don't stick sometimes. So there you have it, my top 10 cheap 3D printers for beginners. Hopefully you found this video useful and you now have a better idea on which printer to go for for yourself. So that's it for this video, if you enjoyed it and you found it useful, then smash that like button. And if you're interested to see more videos like this, then consider subscribing. And don't forget to hit that bell icon to be one of the first to know when my videos are out. So take care. Happy printing and I'll see you next time. Bye.